Why do we have science policy interfaces? Fundamentally, they are there to ensure that the decisions taken by governments and legislators at all levels have the strongest possible basis in up-to-date evidence rather than ideology, assumptions, misinformation, or simply ignorance. Conventional science policy interfaces do this by bringing together experts formally in order to provide reports and insights at key moments in the policy process. But there's also a more permanent interface between science and policy, that provided by libraries. Based in government departments and parliaments, they are there to ensure that decision makers can make sense of and make decisions based on the latest research. Being placed where they are, means that they can build up a solid understanding of the needs of their primary user base, ministers, officials, legislators, and others. In particular, they know how to present and package information in ways that help it get noticed, as well as applying key information literacy skills to identify the highest quality sources. This is a global role, as our policy brief sets out. In Argentina, for example, the Library of Congress has set up a scientific research and liaison unit which shapes the production, circulation, and use of knowledge to support public policy making. Alongside overviews of the current state of knowledge in key areas, there are researcher residences, the sharing of resources, and a program of activities bringing together scientists, policymakers, and social and cultural leaders. The role of libraries is also one that makes a difference in a crisis when governments and legislators are called on to take high impact decisions at high speed. Getting information to where it needs to be matters. During the pandemic, the scientific community did its job by developing the insights that helped develop treatments, vaccines, and wider responses. But for this to inform policy, it took the work of evidence teams built around librarians to scan, sort, and process information into a form that governments could work with. How to do more? In addition to constant efforts to enhance professional practice in libraries, Ministers and senior officials should integrate libraries better into their own planning and ensure that they can fulfil their missions across ministries and levels of government. We can also do much by promoting open access, widening possibilities to draw on research, as well as boosting transparency by ensuring that the public too has access to key policy, policy relevant research.